Hello everyone! Today I'm going to show you how to use Data Newman Outlook Repair to recover corrupted Outlook PST files. Now when your Outlook PST files are corrupted or damaged and you can't open them normally, you can use Data Newman Outlook Repair to scan the PST files and recover as much data as possible. Now, before we begin, one important thing to note is that before recovering any corrupted or damaged PST files with Data Newman Outlook Repair, make sure that you have already closed Microsoft Outlook or any other applications that may access the PST file you are trying to recover. Now, to begin, let's go ahead and start Data Newman Outlook Repair. Once the program is open, you'll want to select the corrupted or damaged file to be repaired. As you can see, we can input the PST file name directly into this field. Or we can click the button over on the right to browse and select the file. If you know the Outlook version of the source PST file to be repaired, you can specify it in the combo box beside the source file edit box. If you leave the format as auto determined, then Data Newman Outlook Repair will scan the source PST file to determine its format automatically. However, this will take some additional time. Next, you'll want to set the output file. By default, Data Newman Outlook Repair will save a new file and for the file name, it will just add the word fixed onto the end. As you can see in our example, we have outlook.pst and the fixed file is going to be named outlookfixed.pst. If you would like to use a different name or save it under a different location, you can set it in this field or click the button on the right to browse to the folder to save it to. Now, as before, you can select the format of the fixed PST file in the combo box beside the fixed file edit box. If you leave the format as auto-determined, then Outlook Repair will generate the fixed PST file compatible with the Outlook installed on your local computer. Next, we can click the Start Repair button and Data Newman Outlook Repair will start scanning and repairing our PST file. This progress bar here will indicate the repair progress. And once the repair is finished, we'll get this message pop up here that says the file has been recovered successfully. Now that our file has been repaired, we can close Data Newman Outlook Repair and open the fixed PST file in Microsoft Outlook. The whole folder hierarchy will be reconstructed in the fixed PST file, and the emails and other objects are recovered and put into their original folders. For the lost and found objects, they will be put in the recovered group folders. So that's it. Congratulations. If you've been following along here, we just fixed our first Microsoft Outlook PST file with Data Newman Outlook Repair. If you'd like more information, make sure to go to datanewman.com slash outlook repair.